Warning, what you're about to experience is based on real paranormal events. Research of the occult has shown that heightened moments of emotion, such as fear, can encourage the manifestation of hauntings. If, after playing this game, you experience abnormal happenings around your home or have southern changes in the behavior of yourself or loved ones, reach out immediately to your local church or paranormal investigators. We've been waiting for a long time. We made a video of this before, the demo, and you guys loved it. As did I. I said back then that this was one of the best horror games I ever played. I usually don't do this before the video starts. But if you enjoy anything from this video, remember to like it so I know if you want to see more. Also, I want to thank you guys for reaching 40,000 subs. We are less than 10,000 subs away from our goal of 50k before the end of the year. Here we go, guys. My name is Fisk. Enjoy the video. I'm so glad it's almost over. Congratulations, sweetie. <laughs> Thank you. I'll never understand why you chose such a macabre field. There's nothing but... disturbing about it. It's just but that I... I'm proud of you. I really am. You've come so far. So, you haven't told me what's next. Will you get a job where you are, or...? They actually have everyone they need. But my old teacher, Mr. Delver, transferred me to his office to finalize my internship there. Oh, well, that's good. I remember you mentioning him. Where's he located? Are you moving away from me? <laughs> no. No, I'm not moving. He's actually located around here. River Fields. Oh, Rebecca. I don't like that. Grandma. Even I've heard things about that place. I'd just be worried people about you. make up stories. Death is a scary thing to a lot of people. And we try to explain things we don't understand, and we want comfort when we lose someone we love. I mean, no one's embalming any ghost bodies or whatever. It's fine. Right, right. I'm sorry. But I wanted to give you this anyway. So, here. I, I don't know if I want that. Just take it, please. It should be yours anyway. Thanks. All right, enough spooky stuff. I'm so proud of you. When is all this happening? When do you start? I've actually been there for a few weeks now. My review is tomorrow. So, Gam Gam seems to be a little bit superstitious, eh? I can't stress this enough. If I remember this correctly, this is a solo dev that made this game. Which is kind of incredible. Alright, here we go. Alright, Rebecca, we're here once again. The coffee pot, we got the mugs. Without actually having to say anything, I feel this is gonna get pretty dark pretty goddamn quick. So if that's nothing for you, you better get out. We got his desk. Is he actually here? Let's see what's going on. Rebecca, one last thing I forgot to give you. Please grab a pencil from my desk and sign thanks. Zoe. Yes, good luck. Something tells me that we're gonna need it. We got the bathroom, we remember that, we got all the stuff that we need, we got the fuses here, okay. I think it's really good to check all of this before it starts getting spooky, right? This is all the bodies. So apparently with the bodies, there's five different endings, but the way you play through is pretty much always gonna be random. Alright, let's get that pencil. There we go, it's signed. And I guess we're ready to go. Oh, we already got the body. That's not the old woman we worked on before, was it? Is this even scare when the sun is out? Rebecca. Oh, great. Perfect timing. Raymond. I just finished with Mr. Dalton here. Please wheel him back to cold storage and bring us Mrs. Page. 
Dude, we didn't see Raymond before. How amazing is that? We just heard him on the on the phone, right? All right. We're going to wheel you back. Oh my god, this is heavy. Let's see. What was your name? Let's see here. Oswald Dalton. All right, Oswald. All right, so far so good. We got Dorothy Page right here. Now. Oh. God, I hate old ladies. That's the girl that we worked on before. All right, Dorothy. Follow me now. Oh, look at that. It looks like... Oh, the eyes are open. That's horrible. All right. I'm just finishing up something here. So why don't you grab the clipboard and start recording identifying marks? I'll get out of your way when you're done and let you hop in here. All right, Raymond. I can do that. So we got Dorothy Page, age 87. Let me see here. What do you have? All right. We got the foot right there. Nothing really on the hands, what I can see. It's just freckles, isn't it? Oh my god, Raymond! These old windows never stay latched. Liar. I feel like Raymond, he knows what's going on. Oh, we got, yeah, we got that on that side. Did I actually get that from this side? Okay, that's perfect. Now we're moving on to the worst part. When you get above them like this, look at that. All right, let's rotate. Rotate this way. What is that? I hate those holes in the skin. That's gross. All right, Dorothy, I'm going to put your head down and we're going to move over to this side. How you doing, Dorothy? Are you feeling okay? What is that then? Is that just a birthmark, you think? Yeah, that's it. Oh, no. Yeah, it looks like worms coming out of that hole. That's gross. It's probably not. It's just like body seats or something like that. But that's, yeah, that's gross. That is really hard to see when she got the freckle, freckles all over, right? Great. Climb on in here and put everything into the record system. All right, I'll do that. Those, Don't that actually made me a little bit nauseous. So Zoe can add it to the packet for the family. After that, we'll get started. Roger that, Raymond. Okay. Yeah, I think I remember this. Record. What was that? I didn't say anything. You all right? No, what was yeah. that? I'm fine. Sorry. All right, we're just going to do what we usually do in these uh, situations. We're just going to pretend everything is all right, and we're going to ignore everything weird. Shall we? All right, head, rash. We have the right shoulder. We got the blemishes. Left arm. A rash. Right leg. Yeah, here we go. Contortion. Is that what you say? And left leg. Heracalosis. There. <laughs> Submit. So we got another entry as well. That's also new. Before we just worked on one body, if I remember correctly. And we're going to pick this up. Yoink. File up front so they are available if requested. All right, let's go. Raymond is watching us. <laughs> let's keep on walking. Schlap. No? Schlap. 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 Time to embalm. Time to embalm. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Now it's time to empty her of everything. Right. I've set everything out so you can just go ahead and get started. I'll be monitoring. Thank you, Raymond. on your list there if you need it. Thank you, Raymond. What's that? What are you doing? Are you eating candy, Raymond? Because if I'm going to do this, I need your full attention. I don't need your paper sounds just going into my ear holes, all right? Needle injector and setting settings needle. What's that? Can I open this? Raymond, I can't open nothing. What? Oh, I never listen, do I, Raymond? I'm sorry. What is that? Moisturizing wipe. Setting needles, we need that. Barbs with length of wire used with a needle injector to wire jaw shut. A tool used for hammering setting needles, bar setting needle barbs into skull. All right, we can do that. That's brutal, ain't it? Damn. Jesus! Shut the mouth. All good. We need to close those eyes. That's creeping me out. Damn, Raymond. Is there anyone in the comments that has been working or works like the work with this? Props to you, man. I would never be able to do that. Insert eye caps. Oh, what's that then? Eye caps, this gotta be it. Yes. Yoink. Alright, put that in. Boop. 
So I guess the eye caps is for yeah. like keeping the roundness of the eyes, is it? Because right now we're just preparing them for the funeral, aren't we? So what do we need here? Mixing the fluid is uh, Galta Huredi, right? Methanol. <laughs> All right, we're going to make up our own words for this. We're going to call it glue, meth. No, we can't do that. Methanol, hum, and formaldehyde. Open that. Methanol. Oh my fucking eye, dude. Sometimes we get chemicals that haven't been stored properly, and it can make them pop like that. You Just are full. Doing your thing. You're full of shit, okay. Raymond. From all the hood. There you go. All good. Oh yeah, no, we need to attach the pumps to her, don't we? All right, let's do that. Let's. I think we need to cut her in the neck, right? All right, Gam Gam, you're all hooked up to the machine. Look at you being all cyborgish. Start that, and she starts leaking. She's all done. Oof. And now we should disconnect her from that, right? Here we go. Oh, okay. Sweet. We didn't have to pick anything up for that. So what do we have now? Raymond. All right, we need to fill the bag with the cavity fluid. Oh, whoop, 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 whoop. The cavity fluid, is that something you put in just to keep them fresh? Is that it? So this is the gro gross part. So we're just going to make this quick. All right. All done. You happy? Do we need to? Okay. No, no, no. We stitched her up. That's all good. Mix cleaners in the bathroom closet to create tank cleaner. All right. <laughs> I was about to say, who did that? It was me. <laughs> Clean a base, is that all? There we go, we're cleaning it. We're doing good, Raymond, you and I. We're such a dream team. Oh! He knows, dude. Look at those dead eyes. He knows. No way he missed that. You're up to something, Raymond. I feel it. Apply moisturizer. Let's wipe this bitch down. <laughs> Oh! Tell you what. What? Why don't you go ahead and head out? I'll take over from here. Did you see uh, that, Raymond? Are you sure? I just got here. Don't worry. You're doing great. I'll get the last of your paperwork sorted today and call you in for your first shift. All right, Raymond. Have a good day. Go ahead. It's fine. See ya. I'll give you a call when we get someone. Don't call me. Don't ever call me again. I don't want to do this. It was just really Oh, weird. Well, yeah. Well, some stuff fell over. That's not a big deal. This is where no, the demo started. It wasn't even my fault, but he sent me home right after that. I'm just really worried. He was supposed to finalize my stuff today. And he said he would, right? Yeah. So that's a good thing. Yeah, it just didn't feel like he meant it. Like, like he just said it to get me out of the building. Oh, wait a sec, I have another call. Hello? Hey, Rebecca. It's Raymond. Oh, hi, Mr. Delver. Uh, look, if I did anything wrong today, just... No, no. Uh, I wanted to apologize. You've done a fantastic job. Just not feeling too well. That's uh, actually why I'm calling He's up to something. Take care of well, uh, yeah. Uh, are you sure? I mean, of course. <laughs> Excellent. You are doing me a huge favor. I took care of the rest of your onboarding. We're all set. And your new badge is in your personal belongings drawer in the back room. That's great. Uh, thank you. I I'm on my way right now. I hope you feel better. Thanks again. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Nah, yeah, he's up to something. Did you hear that? Holy shit. That was him. He signed me on. He needs me to come in tonight. <gasps> See? I told you it was fine. Congratulations. Thanks. I have to go. Like, right now. I'll talk to you later. Working nights at the mortuary. Imagine. Yeah, 
So we're gonna turn that off. What? What? What did you say? Where's my key? Music band shirt. Sports. The nicest people are dead. You're so edgy. Did I say that the last time I checked that? Yeah. Tooth. Yeah. Chips. Yeah. Oh, there they are. Yoink. And we're off. Get ready, dudes. We're in for a ride. Oh, it's not our first shift, but I guess it's our first shift alone, and that's a night shift, that is. Oh, right. oh. Guess I'll head back and get started. <laughs> Wreaking havoc. Fuck you, base. <laughs> Close that. You know what? Screw you, Raymond. Making me work night shifts. Let's close that. We should lock that, right? Oh. Wait, is that Raymond? Oh, is he angry because I threw that out? <gasps> He's calling me. Hello? Hi, Rebecca. Mr. Delver, I need help. Someone's outside the mortuary. Just try yep. to stay calm. It's Raymond. I know you're scared. I'll unlock the door in a moment. What? This is very sudden, but listen to me. We have to start right away. I'm sorry. He knew. I didn't know until it made itself known this morning that it was here, let alone bound to you. Oh. I had no way of knowing the possession had started. What? We're actually possessed? This isn't funny. Stop. You need to take this seriously. You need to act quickly. This is insane. I'll just leave. I'll, I'll just fucking leave. You can't leave, Rebecca. I, I can't allow that for you or for others. It's far too dangerous. <laughs> what am I supposed to do then? Most bodies I work with at night are fine. So we stay calm. Stay calm. All right, we can do that. We embalm, right? All the paperwork, everything. Treat it like a normal day. Staying focused will help. Mm -hmm. I left some things for you on the desk. I'll call again when you get to the embalming room. No, all right. Wait. Ugh. Damn it! What the fuck? Ooh. This is insane. We're possessed. That's crazy. That we didn't know that the first time we were here, right? This is so stupid. It's just some hazing for the new girl or something just just play along and do your job play along and do your job exactly so we actually asked this when we played like why is she acting so normal when doing this wait why are you back how about that um rebecca here you go that's our thing tape recorder old key and a whole key Oh, the old key's gotta be for that cupboard, right? We didn't check that out when we were in there. Let's open this hole. Oh, all right. I'm fucking quitting tomorrow. I mean, who does something like this? All right, listen carefully. I'm, look, I'm sorry, but this entire thing is extremely unprofessional. If this is how you treat new hires, I don't think I can work for you. This isn't funny. Rebecca, you don't have to believe me. But I hope you do before it's too late. The only way to save yourself is to banish the demon before you're too far gone. To do that, you will need to learn the demon's Wait. Name, find it to its chosen body, and burn it in the retort. Wait. Look, I know this is a lot to take in. I wish I could that gave me chills. I had years to learn what I know. You have hours. <sighs> I've recorded a number of cassettes to instruct you hope that having a physical object with a known message will help you stay grounded. I won't be calling again. You can't trust the phones. Anything can be manipulated. Listen this can be manipulated then. Learn the demon's name. Burn the correct body. The most important Wait. thing in the room is in that cabinet. Demon's name. Open Burn the body. Good luck, Rebecca. I'm sorry this had to happen. <laughs> This is insane. Whatever. Just a professional <sighs> one. Grab a body and get started. Dude, I swear, why is this happening to me? You not you guys know I will fuck this up. We can just give up right now. Hey, demon! Take me, body! <laughs> Drag me to hell! <laughs> Tape. Alright. The night shift database. A computer program combining all my findings into one reference point. The database Whatever. contains Just all the information on the process of exposure. Rebecca, shut it! Used, ...and most importantly, all the markings of the known demonic names. 
Markins. Don't forget what to do. Replay these tapes or look it up in the database. The collection of demonic names is the most crucial piece to the puzzle. You will need this information. Okay. My ID card is in my personal belongings drawer. On the back is the passcode to access it. Use it. Okay, so we need to... Wait, wait, let's open this. Old key. I didn't know what we were doing with this before, right? All of whatever this is. I'm getting back to work. No, no, no. Rebecca, we need to focus on this. So this is the markings. Okay, so I guess we're going to find the markings that we need for this. And put it in here to expel the demon? Maybe? Dude, he can't tell me stuff like this. It's an overload of inform information. You know, and I forget everything. All right, we need to get in here. He said... Stop. Ooh, what's this? The Book of Typhon. Let's try to read this. You guys know me and dyslexia. We're gonna... <laughs> but we're gonna make our way through this. Typhon walked among his disciples. And he spoke. He who does not truly let the Lord into his heart shall be judged by his sin and destined to serve those who truly believe. For all are assigned to the halls of hell. 7. Abandon God as he has abandoned you. Bring Lucifer into your hearts and reveal in his glorious sin of all the damned. There's no hope of God. All are marked for the houses of hell as all are hopelessly lost. You have been left behind. 8. And as he passed, Honoron looked up on Typhon with disgust and said, I will not turn my eye from God. Satan has no dom dominion over the Lord's creation. 9. Typhon looked on, on, on your, that's a hard name, and said, Pray as you wish. Fall to your knees at this moment and call to God. Perhaps today he will step down from the heavens and all doubt shall vanish. 10. Pray to nothing and behold the truth. I will take from your God's creation the ashes of man, for it burns eternal in sinful fire. 11. Typhon held the charred remains of Derod and walked among his dis disciples, spreading his ash upon their flesh, setting the reeds into his hand ablaze. He said to Onron, See now that's all are marked in the glory of Satan. 12. Onron beheld a flash of light upon the skin of each disciple as Typhon passed, and from it he saw a mark burn deep into their flesh. One of three from the houses of hell, for we all are destined to serve his higher purpose. 13. And Typhon extended the ashes of Derod to the hands of Oran, to that name dude, and said, Bear the forgotten flesh upon your own. Ignite its sin and accept the true God. That's a, that's a read and a half, ain't it? Okay, let's listen to these tapes. At every moment, the demon is funneling its energy through you, weakening you until you are unable to resist. Identifying a demonic entity is a delicate balance. The further you are from possession, the more time you have. The closer you are, the more the demon will make itself known, allowing you the information to guess its name and the body Wait. it's bound to. The only way I've found to tell how far along a possession is on your own is to scribble on a piece of paper. Don't think about it. Just scribble. Look carefully. If you notice anything strange, it's starting to take hold. Mm -hmm. There's a notepad and a pencil on the desk Checking from time to time can give an idea of how long you might have. In the front room, Roger that. But what did you say about the... Was this that? A special piece of scripture with the ability to reveal demonic markings. Oh, that's the markings we need to find. When a demonic marking is near, the patch... The per parchment will smolder and combust, bringing the marking into the material world to be found. All right, we can do that. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Wait, we just have one match, though, don't we? Let's put that away for now. To banish a demon to hell, it must be bound to its chosen body and burned. The three objects in this cabinet are your tools. First, the clay tablet in the center. This one? Is called a mark. 
placing the smaller pieces in the correct configuration will spell the demon's name. Second, mm -hmm. the bottles on the top shelf are a special reagent that will react to the mark. Add a bottle to the embalming mixture during the process. Okay. When the mark is placed on the correct body with the reagent inside, it will force the demon to become bound to it. Pay attention to signs that you have chosen correctly. They can be obvious or extremely subtle. Once you are certain the demon is bound to its vessel, burn it. Okay. Finally, the pieces of paper on the right are called letting strips. Oh, there we go. You must inscribe the sigils of its name in our world to begin the evocation. You will need to uncover these sigils to use them. Hold a letting strip up while wandering the mortuary. If it begins to smolder, I already burn, have one of those. You're close. <gasps> when the paper combusts, the sigil has been revealed somewhere in that area. They can be anywhere. So look on walls, under objects, inside furniture, anywhere. The demon will inscribe its sigils over time to try and hide them, so check regularly. Once you uncover the sigils, use the night shift database to decide which demon you're dealing with, and use that knowledge to create the mark. The steps are simple. Add the reagent to the embalming mixture, uncover the sigils, build the mark and place it on the body. Then, when you're certain, burn it in the retort. Okay. So, if I understood this correctly, we need to add this to the body that's, um, that's possessed, right? Or the one that he's possessing that... But we should always do that. If there's one the more body, we should still put this in, right? To the embalming, like, or to the, to the embalming stuff. We just need to figure out which one it is to burn it, if I understood that correctly. Mmm, let's get the clipboard. Retrieve body from cold storage. We can do that. All right, everything is normal. Nothing is scary. It's just another night. So we need to look out for uh, twitching, abnormally stuff, like subtle stuff or the very not subtle, I guess. So what was your name, dude? Okay, I can't see it right now. One second, let me get the gurney and we're gonna figure out your name, okay? I feel like I forgot something, but I don't know what it would be. We'll figure it out. Crummy old building. Yeah. Old building. Lock me in here. It's, it's gonna be just fine. Me. Just old stuff. And it's a storm outside as well, so obviously stuff like this is gonna happen. Down you go. He got a little bit of a smile on him, doesn't he? It's always nice to have happy customers, I guess. Scaredy? Scaredy? Scaredy Matt? Is that your name? That's a stupid name. We're just gonna call you Matt. Damn, look at that. The body jiggles. That's amazing. I'm very impressed so far. Very, very impressed. All right, let's check you out. Mm hmm. Let's see what you got then. Sc Ooh. A scratch? That's got to be. Oh, it's got not have to be a demonic, but. Oh my god, dude. Hello? Job. I'm getting out of here. Are we? I don't care how long I went to school. You career path. Fuck this. Fine. Maybe. Uh, no. Maybe everything's fine. It's it's fine. Wait. No, I, I just, you're just, I just, yes. I, I'm just saying things. I just need to get back to work. It's, it's fine. This is not, that's not you, Rebecca. That's the demon. I am based, basically John Constantine. I know this. <laughs> Sam and Dean ain't got nothing on this bad boy right here. Wait, this guy just sat up and looked at me. That is pretty demonic if you ask me. Or is that just a vision that I had? Ooh, I can't trust myself even. That's fucked. Let me Fuck. turn you over. Another scratch. Okay, this is weird. This is weird. This is typical daimo daimonic, demonic shite if I ever seen it. 
All right, let's turn it back. God, dude, you're gross. Hate your face. Sorry. Uh, we got something on your arm right there. There we go. Ah, here we go. Full access. 65372. Boop. Boop. Skibi. Bibi. Doop. Enter. This database is a collection of all my findings related to the banishment of uh, Covertus demons. The history of the demonic and the tools I have found through my research. Years of travel and uh, piecing together whatever uh, relics remain have been compiled here. Okay, so this is what he's... This is what he was talking about. Markings on the body, large or small, repeat movements. Okay, so here we got pictures of it. So big cuts... Markins. Oh, we got a video. All right. This working? Yeah. This thing is huge. So, uh, I guess, um, this is David. Raymond, this feels insane, but I think you were right. This has happened a few times now, but let me see if I can... Oh! There it is. Fuck. Fuck! Yeah, that's what I would say. But anyhow, let's get back into the record system. We got Mr. Matt right here. Uh, his age is 50. He looked really young for being 50, didn't he? Submit. Perfect. Oh! I need to file the copy up front. <laughs> Way to ruin the moment. Let's see what this is. No! Oh! God damn it! God damn it. What did I expect? Yeah, let's file this. You were in such a goddamn hurry, weren't you? Uh, it's time to embalm. Ooh, she doesn't sound too good, does she? All right, we got the needles. We got the hammer stuff. Let's do his mouth. Flap, 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 and shut it, and shut it, and Thank shut you. it. Stay still, dude. Open your eye. Open it. There you go. Close and All close. Right. The glue, methanol, hum, we're gonna put this in first of all. Yoink, let's not forget about that. We're gonna put in the hum. Stop! Stop it! Cleaners in the bathroom. Old house. <laughs> Always gets me, dude. Oh. Oh, this is working. It's in here somewhere. Opa. Oh. Ah! Okay, so what is that? We got the first one, dudes. You know what? Before we continue here, let's do another one. I feel like we need to do this as quick as possible. Just get all the information we can about the demon. Oh, we can do that. Where is it? On the door? Oh, there we go. On the door, yeah, we got... The second one. It's gonna be a hook. It's, it's almost like a T, isn't it? Let's pull this out. It's gotta be something here, right? All right, nothing. Oh my god, dude! Oh my god, that's fucking gross! Tell me that you guys saw that. Jesus. Oh, to hell with that. Oh my god, I hate tiny girls like that. She was in a cupboard. Close that door. God damn it. That is gross. That is so goddamn gross. Jesus. Ooh. Up you go. 
Matt, stop it! It's like the pr 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 prankster. <laughs> All right, Blondell Ford. That is a female. So let's push this over this way. There we go, Miss Ford. I want you to get out of here. Ooh, look at those cold feet. Gross. Wait, do you think cold feet is a uh, demonic thing? Dude, wait, was there? Entry to Blondell Ford, age oh, 23. She was young. I remember this. Is this Matt? Matt? Mr. Matt, I told you to calm down. Stop. Do 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 do. It's El Elbulman time. I told you, Matt. I goddamn told you, dude. Let's shut her mouth first. Matt! Oh, you're having a party. You're having a goddamn rave when I'm. <laughs> You know what? I'm gonna pull Matt out here. I kind of want to see if he's doing something. Jesus. All right. So we're gonna have to go. Oh, what? Dude, that is not okay. Wait, what? What's what's going on? What happened? I I can't do nothing. Oh. Oh, hell no! Hell no! What the hell is this? A church? It's an upside down girl. Established 44. Jesus, dude. Oh, this is the the thing we saw before. What are you doing here? What? What? Dude, tell me he's here. Raymond? Well, oh, that's... That is super freaky, that. We need to moist her up pretty soon. So let's, uh, let's just go this way. Check this out. Oh! There we go. We got the third one. We need it. one more. That's a weird looking three. All right, let's move to Roos. Oh my God, dude, come on. Oh my Lord. Oh, you pale son of a gun. Oh my God, dude. <laughs> Just right. Stop it. Everything is normal. Everything is normal. Everything is fine. I can't even speak, dude. Let's actually leave her out like that. Now we're gonna get Mr. Chas out. On the gurney, sir. that crawling away oh, wait we can hear whispers where's that coming from what? No. I don't 
no. There we go. And is that it? Really? That's all. Entry three. Chas Downs. Age 38. Head nothing. Uh, left shoulder. Wait, you had two moles right there? Stop. Ooh, the noise that it makes just like that when you're in the computer doing stuff. Far from bueno. It's time to embalm. It's a race against, against time right now. The scribbling is getting more and more clear and we still don't have the third letter. You know what? Let's check this. So we got one, like we got this one. We got the T and we got the three. So it's not this one. It's not that one. Yeah, it's gotta be, we have this, we have that, we have this, we don't have that. This is not it. This is not it. That is not it. So we got the name. Masset is the name of the demon. We got that. We got that. So now we just need to put these in the right position. So this one is going to be up top. So on top. This one. The T to the left. And a 3 to the right. Oh, and the backwards P or I guess G right here. Let's drain him. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. God damn it. Not cool, dude. Not cool. The way they just sit there and watches you, they don't make a sound. That's horrible. the body no 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 you did not no 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 stop it i know who you are stop it god damn it another one look at this just watching me Oh. oh, no, 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 no. I really hope we can get back here. We need to get back. Let's jog on here. We really do need to get back. He's trying to talk down to us. It's not difficult, dude. Just give in. No. I'm not gonna give in, dude. A rock? You killed him. You threw away his love with your selfish sin. In his final moments, he regretted you. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Wait. Your voice. Be more comforting. <laughs> Do it! Just let me hear Rebecca. It will all be over. Oh, that's brutal. <laughs> so let's do this and then we're gonna look at the other bodies as well. Jesus Christ. Um, what am I doing? Uh, fill an empty. Okay, yeah, yeah, we can do that. We can do that. Here we go. Yoink. You know what? Let's put the marker on him. Can we do that? Tr take the marker. Are you sure this is the right one? Yes! Jesus Christ! All right. You stay there. Don't try to play with me, dude. You just done goofed. Oh, wait, am I being too quick to judge right now? Oh, I don't know. He actually made me doubt myself. Oh, no. Let's go and check the other bodies. But don't see anything different on these guys, right? Oh, 
I think we're gonna take a wild guess that this is the guy. But we should be protected, because if this is the body, he should be stuck in this one. Here you go. Let's cross our fingers. This is the right one. Oh, it closed the door. Gotta be him, right? Good morning. It's nice not to be the one down there for a change. Uh, Raymond? Uh, I suppose a first name basis is in order. D did I make it? Is it over? For now. It's never really over. You've come a long way. Did I do it? It's a lot to learn. I'm so glad I'm here. I know it's disorienting. You'll get used to it. You should head home and get some rest. Every night can be different. I think I'm fine. Are you sure? No. I'm out of it. No. I've just been waiting. No. For so, oh. so long. I was sure. What are you? What did I do wrong? You chose the wrong body. Rebecca. Rebecca's not here, you fucking <laughs> idiot! Consume your worthless soul, watch your foolish boy, and drink it as it melts from your pit of a brain! Worthless old shit! Vecna! 